What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Today, we're gonna be playing a game where I run over zombies in order to make money. And then I can use that money in order to buy upgrades so that I can run over even more zombies. Let's do this! Go! Obliterate the zombies! Uh, crap. I'm out of fuel. But we made some cash. And that means we can afford to buy an upgraded engine. Sweet. Eventually, we'll be able to get enough money in order to unlock some really overpowered cars. But for right now, I'm stuck in this hunk of metal. Die, zombies! Come on, you can do this! Go! Destroy the zombies! I think I killed three zombies. These are rookie numbers. Upgrades. Oh, we could buy more fuel. Go! Booyah, baby! Get out of my way, zombies! A little bit more fuel. Boom! Pow! Die! Oh, yeah, we got four! Five, six, seven, eight. That is a brand new record. <laughs> we can get a metal buffer. Zombie smash. I completely forgot. Every single time that you guys leave a like on today's video, another zombie will spawn in that I can destroy in order to make even more money. And by making more money, I will be able to afford even more upgrades. I can get a shotgun. Oh, yes, dude. Here we go. <laughs> What the flip? This is awesome. All of the zombies are getting exploded. Let's go, dude. At the top of the screen, you guys can probably tell that there's a progress meter. Once we get to the end, we'll reach the evacuation point and we'll be able to get to the next area. We're about a third of the way right now. Excuse me. Pardon me. I have a tennis appointment. We have enough money to unlock a brand new vehicle, the Hippie Mobile. I guess right off the bat, we should add some more fuel. I am Beck Bro Jack, destroyer of zombies. Just kind of a little bit ironic because my Minecraft character is technically a zombie. This thing is already way better than my last crappy mobile. It has so much more fuel. Dude, this is where I would always stop last time. <laughs> Let's go. A little bit further. You know, you could go a long way in the zombie apocalypse with a good set of wheels. How much further did we get? Wow, dude, I almost made all of my money back. I guess you gotta spend money to make money. Let's upgrade my engine. We're gonna reach the end in no time. Excuse me, pardon me, got places to be, people to see, zombie apocalypses to end. I am going to single-handedly end this entire zombie apocalypse. Not today, though. I think with a little bit more fuel, we might be able to get to the next area. These poor zombies don't even know what's happening. They're just out having a nice stroll in the South Valley Desert. And out of nowhere, I come in and kill them. I mean, that's what they get for being a zombie. They're just asking to die. Even though, technically, are they already dead? Oh, rip! Oh, we're so close! So when I stop, do the zombies kill me or do I just frantically run back to the garage? Let's upgrade our gearbox. That way we can go even faster. And I think we might be able to get to the end. Excellent. Yes! Come on! A little bit further. It's all downhill from here. No, dude, I'm out of fuel! I got that last guy, though. Maybe these spikes will do the trick. <laughs> if the zombies weren't already dead, they are for sure dead after I hit them. If you guys are enjoying this and do want to see more zombie destruction, make sure you let me know in the comment section down below. We reached the end. Checkpoint reached. It looks like our final destination is all the way in Oregon. I don't know why anybody would ever want to go to Oregon. We got to move real slow. We don't know what kind of zombies we're dealing with. Uh, never mind, they're just the normal zombies. There's nothing weird about these guys. I've run over dozens of these. This is like a hot knife cutting through butter. Okay, wait, the obstacles are starting to get a little bit more intense. Who put a bunch of crates out in the middle of the desert? What kind of moron did that? That's nothing a good gun can't fix. Out of my way! <laughs> Yo! Let's go, dude! This is amazing! 
me and my giant machine gun rolling through the zombie apocalypse. Having a good time, having a great time, running over zombies left and right in the zombie apocalypse all by myself. There is absolutely nothing that can stop me! I am Vic Project, destroyer of zombies! Uh, except for fuel. I guess fuel can stop me. However, we should be able to fix that with my brand new hot rod car. Look at that, it's got flames on it. That's how you know it goes fast. Whoa! Yes, dude! I can break all of their kneecaps now! In my old car, I was bashing through their chest. I will get to the end, even if it is the last thing that I do. Okay, maybe... Hold on, hold on, wait, wait a second, hold on. Can we... Hey, 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 I still have more fuel. Can we, can we keep going? I might want to get my other car back. Check out that gun. I need it. Keep going. Whatever you do, do not stop. Yes. Wait, we got a new record. Keep going, keep going. I said keep going. It seems like the best thing to upgrade is the engine right off the bat. I think that just makes the car more efficient. I also really haven't questioned how I'm able to get all of these amazing car upgrades in the middle of a desert during a zombie apocalypse. Like, who is supplying these? Is Amazon out here still doing two-day delivery within the zombie apocalypse? That would be pretty impressive. I honestly wouldn't put it past Jeff Bezos if he has drones out during the zombie apocalypse, still trying to make money. He's after Elon. Guys, we are absolutely smashing this right now. <laughs> this is flipping insane. This used to be one of my favorite games when I was like 10 years old. I used to play this game at school instead of doing my work. I'm not saying you should ever do that, but if you have some free time, actually they probably block it at school now. I live during the wild west of internet. Don't mind me, zombies. I just need to murder you so that I can get money. I'm like a hired zombie assassin. I also haven't really figured out who's actually paying me. Somehow I just get money, and then I pay Amazon, and then they give me all of these pretty sweet car upgrades. I try not to question it too much. I really haven't tested out the propeller booster yet. This seems like a pretty good addition. Let's test out our boost. Whoa! Holy smokes! What the flip? <laughs> we don't really get that much boost, but wow! I was absolutely roasting zombies! If I use my boost at certain times, I think I'll have a good shot of actually beating the stage. I think it's best for uphill, kind of like right there. We're getting really low on fuel. No, a little bit further. Don't stop now. Why did you stop? Yeah, I could see this being a pretty good thing to add to my car. I am slicing through zombies and barrels like it is my job. If I'm able to survive this, they're probably gonna make a movie about me. I want Keanu Reeves to play me. He's the only man fit for the job. Okay, we might have to boost our way to victory here. Here we go. Go! Out of fuel, we still have boost, and we made it! We're at the auto service shop. Is this where I've been buying my upgrades from? I'm looking for a challenge. I really haven't found any zombies that are gonna give me problems. Like, it seems like my biggest struggle is just fuel. Like, I kinda just run out of fuel. Also, apparently zombies chase me and try to jump on my car, so that's a little bit terrifying. I guess these are more like World War Z zombies and not like Walking Dead zombies. Again, who is putting these flipping barrels out in the middle of the desert? Did they not know that there's a zombie apocalypse? Again, that is nothing that a light machine gun can't fix. Honestly, this is the most zombie apocalypse mobile I think that's ever been in existence. I have a booster, I have spikes, and I have a giant machine gun on the tip of my car. Like how much better could it get? It turns out that spamming boost right at the start of this level actually does amazing things for you. You could fly through the entire level. Let's test it out right here. Lift off. Ooh, we can get a truck. The next vehicle though, that's looking good. I gotta get my hands on that. Let's see how the truck does. I mean, it doesn't have the spikes or the propeller in the back or the giant machine gun, but it's made by Ford. And everyone knows that trucks get the job done. At least that's what the commercials say. And I do have to say, this thing is a powerhouse. 
That was bad timing for me to make that comment. Just killing zombies, killing them left and right. A zombie runs up on me and I kill him. And a zombie gets in my way and guess what I do? I run him over because he's a zombie and he doesn't have insurance and the cops don't care because the cops are dead because everybody's a zombie. That's my zombie song. Where did that zombie come from? God sent him down from the heavens. Let's see, what can money afford? I do appreciate the gearbox upgrades and the engine upgrades. However, I think I kind of want to get my hands on this giant minigun. I mean, that's the first thing I would buy if I had the opportunity to in a zombie freaking apocalypse. Look at that thing. It doesn't have that much ammo, but it's fine. It looks amazing. Excuse me, pardon me. Also, why are those zombies standing up on those platforms? How do they even get up there? Can zombies climb? I know they can climb over fences in like little areas, but can they climb over giant, like tall buildings? I somehow did worse with the minigun. Maybe it's because I need more ammo? Now I have 16 bullets. Down to eight. Okay, five, four, two. Okay, we're down to, okay, zero bullets. That barely got me through that stage. Yes, new record. Those are some gargantuan wheels. Let's buy some more fuel, some more ammo. That, ladies and gentlemen, that right there is a truck. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. The bigger the wheels, the cooler the truck. That's why they're called monster trucks. Those are the coolest types of trucks. Oh, yes, dude. This is sick. Just keep driving, just keep driving. Don't stop driving, just keep driving, just keep killing, just keep driving, just keep killing. Come on, a little bit further. Don't run out of ammo now. Don't run out of fuel. Oh, come on. Front flip. Nailed it. Please tell me we got it. I need literally one more bar of fuel. How did we not get there? I guess the only way we can get there is with the jet turbine. Sounds good to me. For it! Yeah! <laughs> I just flew over like a third of the map. There's another game that kind of reminds me of Earn to Die. And I forget what it's called. It's like you, you buy cars and then you upgrade them. It's like mountain climber cars or something like that, but you upgrade your cars and then you can eventually go on different planets. If you guys know that game, comment down below and let me know if I should play that. But we got to the checkpoint. We're officially halfway to our destination of Oregon. Still don't know why we're going to Oregon. Smash like, like I smashed those zombies if you want to see a part two.